it down to those individual stock recommendations then. And uh, Kunal, maybe not RIL, but what are you looking at on the charts? Or is it RIL? No, I think it's not RIL. Okay. <clears throat> but I think uh, Indastar is something which has started to look attractive on the charts. And I think yesterday's move where the stock managed to come back towards a multi-day uh, multi uh, swing breakout about the 345-346 mark, I think makes it a strong case that the momentum could continue. So would suggest a buy with a target of 370, stop loss could be kept at 348. And ICICI Bank is the other stock which again from the private sector banking lot uh, looks attractive. The stock closed about the 1200 mark, uh, in fact made a fresh multi-week swing high on closing basis also. So would uh, read it about ICICI Bank, targets of 1250, stop loss revised to 1190. Okay, let's find out what Nuresh is picking out and Nuresh, what's the strategy? So first is a buy on Grasim, a new 52-week high year, strong momentum. Looks like it could continue towards 2800, stop loss now to be placed at 2500. Second is a buy on Kotak Mahindra Bank. The stock has gone through almost a three, four year period of uh, zero return. Uh, on the downside, it broke below the major support levels of 1600, 1650, but has recovered well. The previous uh, resistance comes towards the 2000 mark, which was a problem area. So for now, it has still underperformed even in the short term to the rest of the banking space. So it's a catch up trade uh, for the next few sessions, a target price of 1880 to 1950, stop loss to be kept at 1770. There you have it. That's the view coming in from our charters, all the top mid and small cap ideas. Now let's... If you like this video, then like, share and subscribe to ET Now.